Hey guys, it's Shadow. Today I wanted to show you how to do a 21 pop archers build with the Lithuanians. Most other civs will do a 23 or even 24 pop archer build, but because of the extra starting food for Lithuanians, 21 pop is actually quite comfortable. And this gives you a lot of options when heading into castle. It can also catch your opponent off guard, as with this uptime most civs will be going for scouts, not archers. I'm going to speed it up a little bit. It's pretty standard 6 on sheep and 4 on wood. Of course at the same time you want to be getting your map all scouted, finding your remaining sheep. And as soon as you've got found your 2 boars and 6 sheep you want to send your scout to your opponent's base to start scouting them. So, your 11th villager goes to lure your first boar. Your 12th villager builds two houses. And your 13th villager builds a mill. The villager before will help build this mill as soon as it's completed building the house. The next two villagers go to berries. And then your 16th villager goes to lure your second ball, which I can't remember where it is right now. But in the game I remembered. <laughs> ah, somewhere over here then. Yeah, just over there. In the meantime, I've got my scout heading towards my opponent's base. You can push deer if you want. Uh, and the next four villagers all go and collect food underneath the town centre. Um, so I was just saying before, you can push deer if you want, but it will put you behind on your scouting for your opponent. You might want to push one deer if they are close enough. As soon as you've got your final villagers, you want to research loom and then click up. As soon as the boar runs out, I recommend sending three villagers to gold and five villages to wood, which will happen in just a second. As soon as you have 170 foot five wood spare, send one villager to build a barracks. This must be finished before reaching feudal. With this villager, I then build a house. As soon as you hit feudal, you want to be placing your archery range down. I recommend building it with two uh, two villagers. Um, it is much faster this way and you can get your rush out a little bit quicker. And the fastest the Dark Age part of the build can be done is in 9 minutes and 40 seconds. And I completed it in 9.42, so it was a pretty efficient start. Um, you should be able to get double bit axe just after clicking up as well. This is very important for getting your production going. And make sure you're building houses as you go, so you start to wall off and so you have uh, pop space. Um, I recommend sending, get training at least 6 archers before rushing your opponent. As soon as all of your sheep have run out, send them to straggler trees. And research uh, build a blacksmith first, and then research horse collar as soon as you can. Ideally, before your blacksmith goes up, you should have two to three uh, archers already produced. Uh, every 60 wood should be invested into uh, farms, accounting for archer production at this point of the game. As soon as your blacksmith is created, you need to be researching fletching.
After you have successfully created six archers, have fletching, and ideally do not get houses, I'm about to in this one. You can then either continue producing from one range and go for crossbows, adding the second range and go for a big crossbow rushing castle, or just focus on getting to castle and going for knights, so your economy balance will depend on this. Um, as soon as you have five to six archers, you can start sending them forward. And at this point, you can see I've already scattered all his base. I know roughly where all of his resources are, so I can start getting ready to hit it. I hope this video was helpful. Please be sure to leave a like if it was and subscribe for more content like this. Thanks for watching.